Sorry for the technical difficulties. My name is Stephen Novick, and I am an eccentric Emmetonian poet. I have five minutes, so let's try to do six poems, shall we? A church locked on Sunday. A church locked on Sunday that doesn't seem right. A church locked on Sunday, and up that stairs of flight, the child ran, filled with delight, even after each chance of five doors to get into a church locked on Sunday. Uh, God, I can't ever remember how to pronounce this word. Obliesque? Obliesque? Obliesque. Obliesque. Thank God it only appears once in this poem. Obliesque. Stone and brick, concrete pyramid cap reads the code. Stands at the entrance to my neighborhood beside the bus stop. Three children, eleven in age. Maybe the girl was a little younger. The boys shrieking in Arabic. They all have to climb, sit, stand, pose, defy polite neighborhood conventions under the oppressive 5 p.m. August sun, waiting for the bus. Their adult supervisor snaps a picture with his cell phone camera. I snap this poem. Mm. All right. yeah. uh, the North Saskatchewan River in the back of my town of Edmonton. The river offers up an image for my poet's eye with the flotsam and jetsam of broken ice chunks riding the surface, and my mind begins to calculate the odds it would take to have a cosmic miracle make all the ice line up to mirror the stars in the sky. Sunday, one of the things we did was we tried to write narrative poems, and well, I tried to write a narrative poem. Write about a current event, I was told, but I'm so slow to decide what to say, unlike the flickering neon light across the street. Can I get to the problem? Uh, can I get to the root of a problem? Can I see an ending that somebody 200 years from now, 20, 2212, set your watches now? What crazy, torturous route will I take? I twist my words around too far. Will they be a drill bit biting into the oil sands? Twist the words again. Will somebody understand in two centuries' time? Will English still be current, still the language of currency? Depression is, is not so great to have in this economy. The war still wages through foreign lands, TV reruns and graphic novel pages. A light still shines to brighten those souls 